Hi guys, Tech James here. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to get a Sega Dreamcast emulator for your Android phone and play Sega Dreamcast ISOs. So what you want to do is head over to the Play Store and the emulator that you want to download is called Rycast. So once you've typed that in, it will come up. Just go ahead and click install. It's completely free as well, which is really nice. So once it's finished running, you can just go ahead and hit open. As you can see, it's very basic. It's got loads of settings down here once you click on the three lines. But what we want to do now is get a BIOS and get a game for it. So back out to your home screen and you're going to want to go ahead and open up Google Chrome. So I leave these um, this link in the description, but basically it's just the Dreamcast BIOS. So it's on Love ROMs. Scroll down. As you can see, here it is. Dreamcast BIOS Android um, Rycast. So go ahead and click download now on that one. Once it's downloaded, it's going to go into your downloads folder. So what you guys want to do is you want to open up some kind of um, file explorer for Android. I use ES File Explorer and I paid for the pro version. So what I'm going to do is just open that. So it's, so it's going to come up. So it's going to come up just like this. You can just navigate on your device. Then you want to go ahead and go to um, sort of like the root of your Android phone. So here is mine on ES File Explorer. Then I want to click the plus icon and add a new folder. I want to rename this folder to DC, all in capitals, and just click OK. It's, you know it's working when it comes up with the Rycast icon. Then what you want to do is head over to your download folder. This is where you're going to find your Dreamcast BIOS. So mine's right here. I'm just going to hold it to select. Then I'm going to tap the three dots at the top here and go to extract two. Then I'm going to do uh, choose path. Now this is where I just find the folder, so DC, and then just click OK. OK again. So then go and extract very quickly. And now it should be working. So back out to your home screen again. Go ahead and open up your Rycast app. So now what you want to do is just click on the three lines up here. Go to paths. This is where you want to select your folders. So select the folder where your um, BIOS is. So click on browse on that. Then scroll down to your DC folder, click on that, click select current folder. Then you know it's working. Go to the back to the home screen and then just hit boot Dreamcast BIOS. So as you can see it booted. If it crashes on first boot, then please just try and do it again because it will work the second try. So once you've got your BIOS and it's working fine, as you can see, I can actually navigate and it will make noises so you can just tell it's working. So once you've got this, back out to the home screen again. Now what you want to do is sort out your game. So once you've got your game, it will be in your downloads folder. So open up your file explorer again, head over to your downloads folder. As you can see, here is my game. So I'm just gonna hold it, uh, go to the three dot option up here and then do extract to. Now you can choose where you want. I'm gonna choose current path, click okay. Right guys, so as you can see, it is finished extracting. Here is the file, Marvel vs Capcom. So all you want to do, you want to head back over to your um, Rycast emulator. Click on the three lines um, in the left, go to Paths. Then where it says Storage Path, you want to click Browse on that. This is where you want to scroll down and choose your Download folder. Then you want to do Select Current Folder. Then go back to the browser. And as you can see, there it is listed, Marvel vs Capcom 2. So what you want to do, you just want to go ahead and tap the game. It's then going to launch it up just in the Sega Dreamcast um, emulator. So what you want to do on this, you just want to tap the screen for the on-screen controls. You can set your date and time. Um, you can pretty much just set it to whatever you want really, it doesn't really matter. And then just go ahead and press A on select. then just going to come up this and it's asking you just to press the start button. Now the game will just boot like normal and this is running incredibly well on my LG G5. It 
It has a small texture glitch at the side of the screen. I've noticed this isn't on all Android devices. If you have it, it's not too much of a problem. You don't really notice it most of the time. So I'm just going to show you guys um, some quick gameplay. So as you guys can see, it's running pretty well. Um, a few text glitches, you guys probably won't have that, it's probably just my phone. But anyway, so now I'm going to show you guys how to set up the um, saves. So once you're just back on the home screen of Rycast, just go ahead and click Boot Dreamcast BIOS. Then you just want to do the setup process, so put in any date you want and then just click Select. Now what you want to do is just scroll across to File, just press A on that. Here you can just create um, save uh, like memory sticks and save files and stuff like that just so it saves your game's data. So as you can see on this memory card it would show my save files. I haven't actually saved anything yet so it says zero blocks but it should add stuff um, once you find it on there so you can just go back. So that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys enjoyed please like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one.